honestly. Mm -hmm. um, I hope everything's honestly. Okay. Well, I found out that uh, some new guys were brought into the booking committee because Kevin had come back. It was me, Kevin, Sullivan, Annette, and Craig, and then a couple other guys were being brought in that were still talents, Paige and Kevin Nash. And in that incarnation of booking, it came to light that in Starcade we were going to beat Goldberg. And I, I didn't agree with that. Um, I was burnt out. I was tired. I was doing nine hours of TV. I mean, it was hard. And when I found out that we were going to beat Goldberg, I, I just, it, 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 to me, that was categorically against what we should have done. And it's easy to look back on it now and say, well, hindsight, but my, my plan for Goldberg, if I was still booking, was to book him on four pay-per-views a year, build opponents for him without having Goldberg on TV, except on Johnny Carson or whoever it is, Conan O'Brien, have him on monster truck stuff, have, see him in other avenues as a big star, mm -hmm. and then say, in 10 weeks on TV, Goldberg live. And have him on TV two or three times a year, but build to it mm -hmm. and have him crush somebody in three minutes. And he would be this mystical, mythical character that you had to watch pay-per-views to see. And I think we'd have done monster buy rates if we'd done our job getting the heel ready. And we had, you know, three months to do it. And I thought that, and, and, and I mean, I may have been wrong. I mean, that may not have worked, but I, it, in my opinion, we could have kept him in that spot and kept him like that for five years. And just create, you know, what only had to do was create four opponents a year for him. And you know he, he could just come on TV and beat a couple of people, but it's like a virgin. Once he was beaten, that aura was gone. I mean, you can't ever go back to being undefeated. <laughs> I I know that sounds stupid when I just said it, but I just felt like he was so special and so just perfect for that spot that we could have kept him whole and not beaten him. And then you know. Honestly, I don't think he ever had to lose. He could have gone out five years later undefeated and the world champion and have a run that we could talk about today. 